Hey guys, my name is Steady Ack and welcome back to another episode of Cabin Crew Simulator here on Roblox. But today, we're going to try an experiment. I want to find out what happens if you don't save everybody or rescue anybody when you crash land in the water. Because we all know the plane slowly starts to sink. Will everybody drown? Will I go bankrupt? Will they take away my pilot's license? Will they make my company bankrupt? I don't know, guys. We're going to find out all this stuff right now uh, in today's episode. So if you are enjoying Cabin Crew or want to see more, then make sure you smash that like button down below. And if you are new in here, make sure you do subscribe so you get notified when more episodes do come out. And maybe we'll do some more experiments. But we're going to first start by creating a flight. And we're going to click select falls uh, And we're going to pick a plane. Now, we want a good plane or a decent plane, not too big that it doesn't sink very well, but we want it big enough that it's going to sink pretty well. And I reckon that we should maybe go with the, the A3, oh, the B77, the A350, oh, KFC Airlines, KFC Airlines, boys. Oh, this could be hilarious. Should we do it with KFC Airlines right now? Let's do it. So let's select KFC Airlines and let's, I don't know, let's fly to Sydney. It makes no difference because we're going to crash land in the water anyway. Go, 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 go. And all we need to do right now is get our pilots, our AI all up and running. And then it's good to go, boys. So what, pl what plane did we select? Was it the A330? I think it was. Uh, done um, and then we're gonna uh, well not we're gonna get AI because they can do the work for me because you know how freaking lazy your boy is right now so I can hire seven as a limit so that is six and then number seven boys and done and we're gonna do a water landing now that's very important right so what's gonna happen is we're gonna fly high into the sky and we're going to cruise at a nice altitude and uh, we only need to serve half the passengers. That's technically all we need to do. Serve half the passengers, and that's when the plane goes into its emergency status for when it then goes to crash land in the water. Now, kind of excited for two reasons. One, I've never ever let a plane sink. I always panic. And I try to get everybody off the plane as quick as possible. Obviously, when you evacuate them, they go into life rafts and the plane slowly just start to sink. At a certain point, I have done it where I've cut it really close and you can actually swim in the cabin. That's how low the plane does sink. But I've never actually just left it where nobody gets off and we kind of just stuck in the water. I've never ever had that happen. Because I normally, like I said, I normally panic and get everybody off. But today we're going to find out what actually happens. If I don't get a single person off, I don't know if I have to open the door to trigger the plane sinking. I don't know. We're going to find this out. But I've never actually failed a water landing, so I have no idea what is going to happen, boys. Give me your prediction in the comment section. What do you think is going to happen, guys? Let me know in the comment section down below. But the last few passengers are now arriving. They're sitting down, and I can board first class. So, KFC Airlines is going to be up and running. We're about to get soggy chicken, boys. Our chicken is about to become soggy. Now, there's not too many passengers we need to get on board right now. So, this boarding process shouldn't take long. I uh, hope you guys bought your snorkel and your armbands right now because we're going for a swim. Uh, oh, this is going to be dangerous, boys. This is going to be low-key dangerous. Right. We'll get the plane in the air. We'll skadoodle out of here. And then we'll crash land in the water. Oof. All right, everyone's now in. We close the doors. And then cabin crew, saints for departure. Are they... Wait. They've already done it. Amazing. Right, let's push back. Let's push back and get this KFC plane in the air. Right, can I take a seat? Now, they normally always take the good seats, so they leave me to the back seats. How dare they? How freaking... Wait, hold on. There's no back seats. Wait, hold up. Where am I meant to sit down? Guys, did you not save me a seat? Is my seat at the front? Yo, seriously? They haven't even saved me a seat. Where am I meant to sit down right now in this KFC airline? How freaking dare they? What is going on right now? Where's my seat? Let me sit down! Wait, is this my seat? Oh, there's my seat. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? Right. <laughs> so... Today, 
feels like a good day to have a crash landing in the water right now, boys. It feels like we're going to get soggy KFC. Now, the only downside is where the gate that we currently picked, they're making us go the long way round. How dare they right now? Now, it's just gone midnight. It took me a gazillion years to get everybody on the plane right now. But we're now going to be skadoodling. So, guys, what are your predictions right now? This is my prediction, okay? This is my prediction. I just, in the back of my head, I have this feeling that the water doesn't, the plane doesn't start to sink until you open the door. I just have that feeling that's how the game mechanics work. I could be completely wrong, but I feel like, I feel like it would literally give us no money. It would say that I failed the flight and pay us zero dollars. That's my opinion. That's my prediction. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below, and we'll see if, if I'm right, or we'll see if you damn folios are right, right now. But, it's going to be interesting, boys. It's going to be very interesting right now. Right, the plane should start turning, skadoodling, and we are skirting out of here. Now, the great thing is, to, to kind of get the crash landing on water to actually happen, we only need to serve half the cabin. We don't need to pick up any trash. And we don't need to prepare them for the crash landing, if I can remember correctly. Um, it just happens as it is. So we should be able to get this pretty done pretty quick, get up into the sky. And I've done four I've done 148 flights. So I don't think I'm gonna get my uh, additional one for 149 flights. I'm so close to 150 right now. Right, okay! Enough jibber jabber boys. We are gonna be heading high into the sky. Ain't nobody stopping me right now, boys. Ain't nobody stopping me. KFC Airlines for the win. Right. Let's get in the air. Here we go, boys. The flight attendants need to be seated for takeoff. So the plane is going to take off. But this plane is not going to land. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Watch out. So, <laughs> I, I sound so evil when I say it like that. Okay, then, right. So, the plane is now taking off. We are going to be zooming in the sky. Here we go, boys. Nice and smooth. Landing gears retract. And it shouldn't be too long before it starts to become daytime as well. It is 3 a.m. in the morning. So, we've got so many AI, I don't need to do anything. I'm going to be like I always am. Super lazy, boys. Super lazy right now. <laughs> Oof. He is a lazy boy. He is a lazy boy right now. But here we go. This is where the magic is now going to happen, boys. So we can now, I'm assuming, jump up. Yep. Yeah. AI? Have, are stuck? No, there we go. They have now moved. Sweet. Yes, enjoy the flight while you can. Uh, right, so they've literally got to serve half the cabin. That's all they've got to do is serve half the cabin right now. And then the flight kind of... Um, Emergency gets triggered and there's not that many people on the plane. So we'll kind of get away with it. It won't be too bad It won't be too bad <laughs> Oh, I feel so evil. I feel so evil knowing that I am uh, going to make sure that all of these damn folios die ah, Someone arrest this damn fool right now Someone arrest him. Here's your boy Zachary right now. Just got one more um, passenger over here to uh, to serve. And they want a nice delicious drink. What do they want to drink? A hot chocolate. <sighs> It'll be the last drink they ever have. So. <laughs> oh, I feel so evil, boys. I feel so evil. So I wonder how long then before the emergency then gets triggered. I wonder what the halfway point is. I wonder where it is. I mean, it's still a fair few to still go. They're taking their sweet time. But any minute now, it's going to happen. And we are going to go down. We're going to go downtown, boys. Downtown! Right, they're actually serving quite a lot. This folio is getting through them quite a bit. Uh, this one, it always kind of uh, annoys me. But the, the one, the cabin crew here has to do both sides. Why can't the, this one here do the person on this side and then this one do the person on that side? Share it a little bit more evenly rather than have to wait for the one to complete it. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. So we do need to make sure they got a life vest on. 
So I can kind of help him do this a little bit right now. Anybody who needs one right now, I can kind of quickly help out. Do my part to make sure that they all die. <laughs> I don't know why you're putting life jackets on, guys. The plane's going to sink. The plane is low-key going to sink right now, so I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> no idea what you're talking about right now. So come on, you damn fools. Get them life vests on. Because you're going down to see Nemo. They're going to find Nemo right now. They're going to find him, guys. And Oh, God, oh, God. This is going to be dangerous. Right, who's left them? There's a few more fools at the back here. Left right now. We quickly throw some life um, jackets on. Everybody here has got one. You ain't got one. There we go. So are we ready for this water landing, boys? Is it daytime yet? The sun is now only just shining. <sighs> are we ready for this? I don't know if we're ready for this right now. I'll be honest with you. I don't know if we're ready for this, but we're going to proceed to land. All right, here we go. Here we go. We're going to have a beautiful crash land right now in my KFC plane. It's the best plane in the world, boys. The best plane in the world right now. I'm now about to crash. Crash land in the water. Here we go. And brace, you fools. Brace. You damn fools. You better brace. Right. The plane is now in. The plane is now landed in the water. Sweet. Uh, oh, once the boarding doors open, make sure the passengers get to the life raft. Okay. We will try our best. Nat. 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 So my interesting kind of point right now is... Right, there's water in the cabin already. It gets to a certain point and you can start swimming. Like, I can start swimming now. But I don't know if it does continually sink. Or do I have to open the doors to trigger the sinking mechanism in the game? I'm not 100% sure right now. Wait, is the plane sinking? Did it actually go down right there? So you can see the water level between the water and the back wing. I don't know if it kind of goes down or whether I have to open the doors to trigger the sinking. This is what I'm not 100% sure about right now. So we'll give it a minute or two and just see if it does slowly go down. But oh dear God, the plane is in the water. These falls are going to die. But inside, no, everyone's calm. Everyone's calm right now. This dude's angry that he's now got um, his, his his underwear is now wet. But everyone else is calm. I don't think this goes down until I trigger the opening of the door. But I could be wrong. Let me go stand over here. And we'll give it another minute or two. And see what happens. But I've been sat here right now for a while. You can see in the game, it's now 4pm. So... The plane is not sinking, so it was correct what I thought. You have to open the front door to, to, to kind of trigger the sinking mechanics in the game. So the plane doesn't instantly sink, so you're kind of okay. But as soon as I open the door, right, they now have the ability to get out. But the only problem is not everybody gets out. Not everybody unless my AI do it all for me. So, and let's be honest, the plane is already half sinking. The plane is already half sinking right now, which is not good. You can see it's starting to, uh, it's going to start dropping down in just a moment. I think we just went down by a little section just there. And the water will slowly start rising. Oh my goodness me. This is terrifying. This is going to be terrifying. But yeah, we're already swimming at this point. Now, the AI themselves, they don't, um... They're able to walk in the water. They don't actually technically swim. Wait, did that person just go use the bathroom? No, that's one of my AIs. That's one of my AIs right now. So they should slowly get off. And there shouldn't really be many issues. But uh, you can see where the water then kind of starts and stops. But this is the problem. The plane is that big. It takes a while for them to slowly get off. So it's now nighttime and pretty much everybody has managed to get off the plane. Right, it hasn't sunk in time. But what I do know is... Right, look at how deep the water's now getting in here. Oh my goodness, you can literally full-on swim. It's terrifying. 
we should complete the flight. Now, what would normally happen if you lost anybody and anybody died right now, it would just say that, you know, missing passengers or something like that, and it would kind of like give you like a, a minus kind of bonus off it. But uh, I don't think it's actually possible to fully sink the plane. So I think they might now be waiting for me to evacuate because the plane is slowly going down, but not enough. Not enough to cause many, many issues. I've uh, I've, <laughs> I've been in planes before that I've literally almost gone over the roof. But uh, they've managed to get off super quick right now. Is the plane going down? Look, you can now see the plane is now officially sinking. It's now officially going down, 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 down. There we go, boys. And we are going to stay inside of it right now and just see what happens. If I go right to the back, there's going to come to a point where I'm going to be underwater. I can't actually get through this bit. Oh, no. I might actually get stuck on the plane itself. I might get stuck on the plane itself. Oh, no. Oh, no. Right. Quickly get out. Quick, 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 quick. Oh! It didn't even let me get out. It's transporting to destination. Is this what happens when you let the plane sink itself? Now, luckily for me, everybody got off the plane. And you can see at the very bottom, passengers lost zero. Now, if everybody died, that number would say the maximum of how many passengers you had on board. And it would just mean that your safety rate intakes a knock. So, in reality, if you let the plane drown, you still earn cash. What is going on? You make money if everybody dies. We'll end it for here, guys. Hope you did enjoy this. I don't know how I feel about this, but until next time, I see you all soon. So, goodbye.